The Vikram 32 is a significant achievement for India's space program, but it's not a direct competitor to the most advanced space grade chips used by global space agencies in terms of raw performance. Its primary value lies in its indigenous development and strategic autonomy. By designing and fabricating the chip domestically, India reduces its reliance on foreign suppliers for critical space and defense technology. The chip's successful space validation on the PSLV C60 mission confirms its reliability, a paramount concern for space grade hardware. Global space grade processors from the US and Europe often feature more advanced architectures and slightly higher clock speeds. For example, the RAD 750 processor, a mainstay of NASA missions like the Mars rovers, is known for its extreme radiation hardening and has a clock speed of up to 200 megahertz compared to the Vikram 32's 100 megahertz. Similarly, Europe's Leon processors are a highly reliable, open source platform used in many European Space Agency ESA missions. While these chips may seem outdated compared to consumer CPUs, they prioritize reliability and radiation tolerance over raw performance, a trade-off that is essential for surviving the harsh space environment. In the context of the global space industry, the Vikram 32 places India in a small and exclusive club of nations with the indigenous capability to develop a space-grade processor. While the world's leading space powers are already moving towards next-generation 64-bit multi-core processors and specialized AI chips for space, the Vikram 32 represents India's entry into a critical technological sector. It demonstrates India's growing self-reliance and lays the foundation for developing more advanced future-proof microprocessors for its upcoming space missions, including the ambitious Gaganyaan program and interplanetary missions.